Good morning, my glam dolls. So today is Valentine's Day, and I am up early because <sighs> we have so much to do. But I do have an appointment today, so I'm just gonna do a little vlog. That way, you guys could see like what I did for Juan and whatever, or what I'm going to do. Um, and I'm also gonna do a seafood boil recipe the way I do it. So if you do want to watch that, stay tuned and. I do want to say welcome to all my new glam dolls. I hit 109 subscribers and I'm super happy about it. So I do appreciate everybody that's supporting me and I love you guys so, so much. So let's just uh, see how today goes and I hope you guys do like my recipe. getting my tubes tied and i am really nervous i never thought this day would come where i actually would go through with it but i will check with you guys in after i get everything checked and i will let you know what happened okay since you guys wanted to see how i make my seafood boil i am going to right now clean everything that i need i only bought two of these because juan is the only one that eats them and they're keen crab legs and they're really big and then I bought my pre-packaged lobster tails. I bought four of these and I bought two two-pound bags of big shrimp, corn, and potatoes. I'm going to, this is the pot I use. And I'm gonna put the water in so that it could start to. I use their petite bread. I'm going to put my stove on six. If you don't have a one of these, it'd be like kind of medium heat, but a little bit higher than medium. Salt. I'm going to add pepper. Oh, pepper. Pepper. Not pepper. Pepper. Now I am going to get 12 garlic cloves. Cloves. I'm going to cut all 12 of them. If you want to add more, you can. The garlic really adds flavor to your sauce. So I did already finally chop the garlic. And I'm going to use this butter, sorry you can see on my garlic scraps, it's extra creamy salted butter and I'm going to put it into my pot that way it can melt. So I do have the butter and the garlic uh, together. I like to put the garlic at the same time as the butter so that way um, the garlic flavor absorbs into the butter. So I will be back once that is melted. So I'm going to start to take out what's already cooked, like my corn. Corn cooks really fast, so you don't have to really wait for it. The thing that takes the longest is the potatoes to cook. But I like to take out little by little what's already cooked. That way, whatever's left, I know I can take out. So I have all my corn out. I am going to check my king crab leg. My tongs. So they are cooked already. I'm gonna allow the water to uh I am going to check my lobster tail. So see how the lobster is turning pink. Everything I have so far cooked is the shrimp, the king crab, and the corn. Here I have my potatoes still cooking and the lobster tail, and we have this boiling. What you should do is get a spoon and just start to stir it. And we are going to prep everything else that we have going on. So I'm going to show you guys oh, what you need. So you need cayenne pepper, paprika, oh, I should have one. chili pepper, red pepper crush, salt, pepper, garlic, powder, onion powder, lemon and pepper seasoning then i need my parsley old bay and you're gonna need cajun seasoning i'm going to start with my parsley first i use like a, a little plate like this my kids plate I'm not sure how much this measures, but if you want, you can use um, a cup of this. This is about the same. So, 
I kind of know how to eyeball it now. So I'm just going to start with my parsley. I'm going to put a cup of parsley. Let me just take you guys with me. So I am going to throw my cup of parsley in there. And we're going to start to put the rest. Okay, so now I am going in with cayenne pepper. I already have one open, so I'm just going to put it into my plate. So I'm just going to use the whatever I have left over in that one. And then I'm going to go into my chili powder. And for these, you're going to put half a cup, depending on how hot you like yours. Now I'm going to put in my Old Bay seasoning. So it's half a cup of all those. Now we're going to throw that into our... And we are going to stir it before adding on the... Rest. Here we are going to stir it so we can have it all melt into it. We are going to add water and stuff, but I'm looking at it. it's way too thick, so I am going to add my water now before I add any more. Here I'm adding a cup, and I'm just going to use the same plate, and I'm going to add a cup and a half into my bowl, into my um. Then I'm going to stir it again to see how the consistency is. So this is my rest of my seasonings. I'm going to add it in there. I'm going to mix it. It's going to get thick again. So if you want to add more water, you can. But at this point, I think I have too much seafood. So I am going to add the other four bars of... Oh my God, it just got all over my wall. The other four bars of butter. I added the butter and the... Um, I added two cups of water because I don't like mine like really thick. But right now it's going to get um, thicker with the butter. So I'm going to check on my lobster tails. So they are turning pink, so they are almost cooked. So we might be able to pull those out pretty soon too. So this is already everything's cooked. The potato, the corn, everything. I have my sauce and I like to keep it on simmer until it is time to eat. So I could pour it on top. And this is my beautiful sauce. Look. Mm. So I like to keep it on simmer. The, the seafood can cool. You could keep it warm if you want. It's up to you how you want to eat it or how you want to leave it. But your sauce, I always leave it on the side on simmer. That way I could just throw it on the top and it will still be warm. Um, this is Juan Pablo Mancias, and then I have the love balloon. I put his favorite beer with a little bow. I put balloons. I decorated with the heart, and I made a box that says, I love you. Happy Valentine's Day with our picture. And on the inside, there's our pictures. I put his favorite chocolates. There's two shirts and two Xbox games in there, but I don't want to pull them out because it took me a long time to get this box to close i made him a love note and i got him those balloons so yeah this is the setup for his valentine's we will see his reaction when he gets home so i know i'm looking rough but i'm gonna get ready in a little bit uh, i'm just going to clean my brows a little bit but i did i'm gonna talk to you guys about how my uh pre-op appointment went for tying my tubes um so they had checked so she did put this little um camera into my up my area to see to make sure everything was okay for the surgery um and sorry it's so hard to concentrate to not take off excess brow hair because i'm trying to grow them out but i don't want to take off too much i did get uh so they did check up there and they did see a abnormal bump on my 
ovary so i do have to go next monday to get it checked out to make sure it's not cancerous so if you guys can put me in your prayers so that um damn it birdie hit me right now um so that everything can come out all right <sighs> si no es una cosa es la otra but anyways um i am going to get ready but i want to get ready at my own pace with music and everything and i do not want to get copyrighted so i will get back to you guys once i'm done getting ready so i did my makeup it's something simple but now we are waiting for juan to get out of work uh he is almost at his boss's house then i have to go pick him up totally forgot to show you guys what the seafood boil oh, look with the sauce you. on top after but i do have a picture so i will uh, post that and i forgot to close out the video and i forgot to record juan's reaction to the thing he was really really happy i mean he always explains to me that nobody's ever done anything like that for him and he appreciates it and i just really wanted to be in the moment for it i really just wanted to obtain like everything that he was saying um so i just decided to not even turn on the camera but at least you guys will see what he got everything i did for him um yeah i hope you guys did enjoy this video make sure you like comment share and subscribe